What's up everyone, TechLoud here and in this video I'm going to compare the YouTube app on uh, Windows uh, Phone 8 and on iOS or in other words on iPhone. If you search the YouTube on Windows uh, Phone Store, you will not find the official YouTube app. However, there is a long list of third-party YouTube apps available including the Microsoft one but that YouTube app is only just a link to the browser or the mobile browser version of the YouTube site and you can see the poor rating on this app and if you check the reviews of uh, this app they will also state the same thing that I'm telling you here as you can see it says uh, no need for this app it will bring you back the back to the browser waste that's actually true and however there are actually some very good third party apps uh, available in the list the first one you see is the youtube hd the the one on the top then you have the tube pro as well which is also very nice then you have the metro tube as well over here the metro tube is also a very popular app and it's a very nice youtube app as well but i prefer YouTube HD over that one but the above all I like uh, one YouTube app more than anything which is MyTube although the there are less ratings on the store however but all the ratings are pretty good about this app and no wonder because this app is really really good and in almost uh, many areas or you can say in 90% areas it is much better than the official YouTube app on other platforms. So let me show you the YouTube app on uh, both these uh, platforms. As you can see the live tile on the Windows Phone 8 it's automatically updating using the subscription the videos that are actually shown in my subscription and I can rearrange the size of this tile as you can see here I can make it bigger so that it looks even more visible and more beautiful and that's really nice and i really love this feature of this app Anyways, uh, let's open the YouTube app on uh, both of these devices. And uh, you can see both uh, have uh, loaded the videos uh, pretty quickly. And the speed actually is slightly better on the MyTube app on Windows 8. But it's pretty close on both of them and both are pretty fast depending upon the internet speed. And this is uh, very nice to see that the MyTube app directly goes to my subscription as soon as I open. Whereas the official YouTube app goes to what's new, what's new tab on uh, iOS or iPhone. And in the settings, I don't see any setting where it shows that I can actually change it to my subscriptions. If I go to the settings on my Windows Phone 8, it will actually have a option to select even the subscriptions or whatever I want to show on the live tile as well. That's also a very nice feature. Anyways, we will go to the settings later. Let's look at the app itself first. And also look at the interface. I like the card design on the Windows Phone instead of uh, the official app on uh, iOS. It has a lot of uh, empty and white spaces whereas on uh, MyTube it's pretty packed and in a very nice card layout as you can uh, see here and the scrolling is also nicer slightly on uh, Windows Phone instead of the official app on uh, iPhone. It has the search option on uh, both phones as you can see the search bar on the top on iPhone and the search button at the bottom on uh, Windows Phone 8. So in order to access the menu, I have to swipe to the right on both phones or I can tap the menu button on iPhone on the top as well. But the swipe 
option is available on uh, both phones in a similar way so let's compare what we have here we have all the things uh, that are available on the official app is also available on this app nothing is uh, left out in any sense as you can uh, compare yourself here the sign out option is available in the menu on windows phone 8 whereas on iphone i have to tap the settings and then actually i have to tap on the account then i can go to the settings and if i want to check out uh, the channels that i have subscribed i can click uh, subscribe to on windows phone 8 and it will show me exactly the same thing that i see on uh, my iphone on the left on the iphone i have the categories on the left as well but on the windows phone if i swipe towards the left then i can actually get the categories as well and you can see for yourself that how good the menu looks on uh, windows phone once again the categories have uh, very nice uh, backgrounds the pictures and the interface looks really nice the card layout is nice and also notice that the search button is available all the time no matter which screen you go whereas this is not the case on uh, iphone so let's go to the uploads on uh, both devices and let's start a video on uh, both of them if i click the uploads at the same time you can see that the mytube is slightly faster than the official app and same is true if i run the video it's uh, slightly faster than the original YouTube app on uh, iPhone. However, in order to play the video, I have to click uh, or tap uh, once on iPhone, whereas on Windows Phone 8, I have to tap once to open the video and then uh, tap one more to play the video. I like the approach on uh, Windows 8. The reason is because if I open that uh, video, it will show me the detail about that video first which means the description the likes dislikes comments things like that so if i don't like the video i don't have to waste my precious uh, data package on uh, playing this video just to check out the description or the comments or the likes or dislikes on that video as you can see although i have uh, clicked later on windows phone 8 but it still loads uh, pretty much uh, instantly and it's very slightly behind iPhone although it is supposed to be much uh, more behind than uh, iPhone. And if I tap on uh, both of them it will bring the, the bottom bar on both of them. But the good thing is that the HD settings is already available uh, here whereas on iPhone I have to actually click the menu then uh, i have to select the quality and then i can access the resolution of that video there are a few more additional options available on windows phone here i can actually lock the rotation of the screen and also i can uh, press the repeat once uh, as well and it will repeat this video again and also for rewind and forward i like the approach on uh, the windows phone 8 because i can actually put my finger anywhere on the screen and i can slide it uh, just like that uh, and it will uh, go forward or backward it's much more convenient and uh, as you can see although the video is playing on the background but i can open the description the likes and dislikes and th things like that i can do the same on iphone as well but uh, check out the scrolling on uh, windows phone is much more smoother than the original app on iphone and if i swipe uh, further on windows uh, phone 8 i can uh, check out the comments i can leave the comments as well whereas on uh, iphone the comments are not available if i click the this uh, expand button then the comments are available and i can check out comments i can leave the comments here so pretty similar sort of implementation but a different way of implementing things so it's up to you how you prefer 
to see different sort of things but uh, the thing is that uh, both phones are going to provide this uh, functionality which is good if i close the app on uh, both phones i have actually checked the option on windows phone that uh, the video will continue to play in the background there is actually a checkbox you can uh, turn on and off this option and that's actually very nice and handy feature on uh, this app on windows uh, phone 8 and i like it very much and sometimes you only have to hear the audio or either you are listening to a podcast or either you are listening to music or something like that you are only concerned with the audio in that case actually you can uh, leave uh, this app running in the background and you don't have to continue to occupy the screen and you can do actually other tasks or you can just simply put the phone in your pocket uh, and uh, go your merry way similarly you have uh, sharing options on uh, both the phones you have uh, social sharing you have emails text messages copy link and the difference is that actually if you have installed any other third party app or any other social app you can actually share th this uh, video to that uh, app as you can see here i have installed uh, Mado, which is a third party twitter app i can actually even share this video on uh, twitter using that third party instead of the official twitter app available both phones are capable to play the video while you are actually searching some uh, other videos or you are browsing the suggested videos or either you are actually checking out the videos of somebody else that uh, is available in your uh, subscription list or anywhere on the youtube so both uh, phones actually provide uh, this functionality and that's very nice to see and both are on par as far as this functionality is concerned as you can see on the iphone the video is running and i can uh, access different things in the menu i can access somebody else whereas on windows phone uh, you can also do the same thing by just uh, pressing the back button the video will continue to play in the background but uh, you can actually keep on uh, searching new videos and uh, both phones when rotated in the landscape uh, direction or orientation both actually maximize the video same is the case on iphone as well however the difference is actually you can uh, lock the screen rotation on uh, your windows phone 8 whereas on iphone you cannot lock the screen rotation in the menu you have uh, these options where you can report a bug you can uh, suggest a feature and uh, you can actually open the help you can open the about same is also available on the official iphone app as well in the settings menu actually i see that the windows phone has uh, more settings and uh, options and features available as compared to the official app on uh, iPhone uh, 5s however there is one additional uh, feature available on iPhone which is actually the feature which will allow you to pair your smartphone with your TV and you can uh, search and browse the videos on your smartphone while you can uh, play those videos uh, instead of your smartphone you can uh, play on your TV However, this option is not available in the Windows Phone version of uh, MyTube app. Similarly, it does not have the safe search uh, filter available. Whereas on uh, iPhone 5s, it, ha it is uh, available. But other than that, there are a lot of features, additional features available on uh, the Windows Phone 8 
as you can see on your uh, right so guys this is the comprehensive uh, walkthrough and the comparison of the youtube app available on uh, both platforms whereas the youtube app is officially available on uh, ios but on windows phone i was uh, comparing a very nicely made third party app which actually surpass the original and the official app on uh, iphone and this is the case where actually the third party app has actually surpassed in uh, functionality the beauty the nice design and interface and usability as compared to the official app and actually i prefer the app on windows phone and i no longer miss the official app on uh, windows phone platform so guys uh, i hope uh, that you have uh, enjoyed uh, this comparison on uh, youtube app and uh, if you have liked the video then uh, please make sure that you press the like button at the bottom of this video and subscribe for more videos like that take care and i'll see you later in some other video bye